derailing overnight just south of the convention center, hitting the overpass on Harbor Drive. 10 News reporter Nate Holmes is in Barrio Logan. Nate, it's going to take crews hours to clear the area and make sure that bridge is safe. Yes, that's right. Well, luckily they've been making some progress this morning, but the crews must remove the derailed cars in order to check to see if there was any damage made to the bridge. Now you can see crews out here working this morning. They got one car upright and they are working on the second one. We are on Arbor Drive across from the Hilton Hotel near the convention center. And earlier this morning, the process was crews had to disconnect at least six freight cars, move those towards downtown before they were able to get these cars out here upright. Now the train hit a pillar that supports the overpass on Harbor Drive from downtown to Barrio Logan. Now the call came in about two o'clock this morning. So far, no injuries have been reported, but it's still unclear what caused the train to derail. Now we're told the company will have a structural engineer look at the bridge once crews are able to move all of those cars. Now at this time, we don't know if the derailment has changed the integrity of the bridge, but as of right now, we can tell you it has not caused any traffic delays in the area. Live in Barrio Logan, it's a Homes 10 News.